The 2016 Consumer Electronics Show is almost here. It's the biggest technology show in the world, and Consumer Reports is headed to Las Vegas. Our experts will cover electronics, cars, appliances, even health gadgets. Here are three trends we expect to see this year. Some of the hottest tech at CES won't be flying in the air or hovering on the ground. It'll be strapped to your face. Virtual reality headsets are taking over this year with companies like Sony, Samsung, and Facebook's Oculus launching products. With a 360-degree headset, you'll be able to explore virtual worlds you can almost touch. And while much of the focus so far has been on games, this year retailers like Lowe's are using VR to help consumers. Lowe's Hollerum, which we'll see at CES, uses virtual reality to let people step into their kitchen or bath designs before they even swing a hammer. This has the potential to save you money as you virtually reimagine your new space. TVs, again, will dominate a lot of coverage at CES. 2016 will be the year that ultra-high-def TVs become mainstream. In fact, this is the first time the Consumer Reports will recommend that consumers buy UHD TVs. That's because standards are now being finalized. We expect to see a lot more 4K streaming options, and the first 4K Blu-ray players will be out this spring. You'll also be hearing more about OLED TVs. More companies are expected to unveil them at the show. OLED UHD TVs are among the best sets that we've ever tested, and competition will only help bring those high prices down. Keeping tabs on your health at home is going well beyond fitness trackers and blood pressure monitors. We'll see plenty of new health technology at CES. For example, there are devices designed to help you track your heart function, almost like a portable EKG. There are also gadgets that will help you determine if you're actually burning fat during exercise. And don't forget about sleep. We'll even see a mattress that adjusts firmness to complement the sleep cycle that you're in. It remains to be seen whether devices like these will really benefit your health, but we'll take a look at CES, and some of them may even wind up in our labs for testing. Follow our full coverage of CES on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, and ConsumerReports.org.